All right, Vicky. Um, clearly, you know, a tough night for you. Not the performance you wanted, but uh, you know, talk about how how you were able to come through and you got fifth in the world. I mean, that's a great accomplishment, and you know, you should be proud of your efforts, right? How do you feel about that? I mean, there's not much to say. It's not what we came here for, so um, I just have to get better. There's a I, we talked, I talked to the coaches after, and um, it's really getting like a, a best go-to attack that I can I can get on anyone in the world and. Um, yeah, I just have some clear things to correct. You know, I think we've made gains and gains and gains, but mm -hmm. it wasn't enough uh, for me to get a medal today. So. Yeah, I mean, was there anything in particular that was frustrating you out there? I mean, you have some of the best offense in the world, right? Yeah, I mean, I think um, I think the Asian countries in particular they do a really good job of, of not coming up. You know, not re not reacting. Um, just, just really solid in their stands. The Europeans are able to open up a lot more. Asian girls really end up having to pick and choose. But as the match winds down, you know, you, there's, you're losing time to pick and choose. Um, so I tried to open up, and, and I think I opened myself up too much and got attacked in that, that second three minutes. So, um, yeah, just that, that was frustrating. You know, I have, to, I have to figure out how to open up without um, exposing myself. You got a lot of people in your corner, a lot of people in the back, you know, the coaches. You got to work with some new coaches, with Smith and Cola, and you got Pendleton. Can you just talk about what those people mean to you, what they've done for you, and how, how they've helped you? Yeah, I'm so thankful. Like, my, the whole coaching staff, it's, they're just the best people in the world. Like, um, Clarissa, Terry, Chris, uh, Cola. You know, Cola's so intense. He's so awesome. I feel like I, I've only spent maybe three weeks total with him all summer, mm -hmm. and I've learned a lot from him. And um, John, Emma... You know, besides the fact that they're all so supportive, great coaches, great technicians, they're um, each and every one of those people are amazing human beings. So I'm so thankful to be surrounded by people that I can look up to um, and aspire to be like in my personal life too. So. Yeah. I mean, what's next for you? Where do you go from here? You got. Um, I'm gonna actually go to India for three weeks to, to train. Um, I got an invitation from a training center down in the south of India. So I'm gonna go for it. Um, I think it'll be. Good. It's, I'm gonna take 10 days off and then get get out there and you know like I said I have things to get better at so just going and wrestling no pressure no no competition just just wrestling and feeling wrestling and, and getting better in the places that I need to get better um, and then maybe that pro league too we'll see.